All right, here we are going in to clean out back here in the storage room. That's not a bad looking pipe. You can tell it's been jetted. Now, you got a little bit of water sitting right here. And this, I feel, is turning back towards the bathroom. Just a little bit of water sitting in that elbow right there where she 90s. Not bad. I just got done jetting the line, so some of this water is residual. Oh, made a couple turns there. Now this is in the clean out, and I believe it's pointed towards the bathroom, but I could be wrong. Looks like right here we're at the T where the two bathrooms come together and I mean it does not look like there's anything standing here I honestly think that a lot of this problem they're having with with the pipes clogging up is simply in the toilet and people putting too much toilet paper and paper towels I mean when I came to clog, unclog this line yesterday it was just in the toilet and it was just a massive amount of paper towels and you can imagine if something clogs a big wad of paper towels gets put in and gets jammed right here then of course you're gonna have your bathrooms clogged up all the time as far as breaks in the line I'm gonna pull the camera out of the line real slow and inspect it for breaks or anything else that may be causing a problem in here but as far as fall and grade on the line she's flowing really good especially for a big shopping center like this See, that's the only water you have standing in here is maybe a half inch coming around an elbow and the lateral pops on either side of this elbow are perfectly clean and clear. So here we go. We're going to pull back out of the line. She's banged up pretty good from a snake. You can tell all the little chips in the line here. Just been smacked around a lot with a snake. <clears throat> clean though. Jetted. You can go ahead and help pull that line in. Yeah, there you go. That's what you do. Alright, so far, not seeing any major catastrophes. Pop pretty clean. See, water flowing right here, fine. I mean, not any problems in the line, just this is probably a high traffic store and a lot of people, a lot, a lot of people come and use this one restroom. They have one restroom that has a door that is locked and they can't access and they have a pair of garden clippers that they're using to get in and out of the door there. So that restroom never even gets used. But you have one that has got seriously high traffic in it and too much toilet paper. To me, that kind of water right there sitting in the line is not a huge concern. I mean, that's maybe half inch, between half inch and three quarters of water right there. I mean, and it's only in a small spot there in the elbow where it fell. There is the clean out that you enter. Right here on the top of this is the clean out that you enter when you go in by the bathrooms and drink fountains over there, which I'm also going to go in that clean out and see if I can go further on down the pipe away from the store and see if there's anything going on that direction. I mean, here we are coming back up out of the clean out. All right, I'm gonna make a second video for the clean out over by the bathrooms themselves. This one's in the storage room.